Waimanalo is a small community along the windward side of Oahu. It is rich in culture and local flavor. The rural town is also the home of one of the newest hubs providing internet and cable services to Oceanic Time Warner Cable customers. This building is actually the culmination of three years of good hard work. So this building is really designed for reliability and sustainability as we, we move into the future with more and more high-speed services and, and greater and greater services to the community. When the hub was initially built, the entire side of the building facing the street was a blank gray wall. The, the blank face of the, the building was, uh, it, quite frankly, from my point of view, was a little bit of an eyesore to the community. So we thought we would do something depicting what Waimanalo was all about and share this with the community as part of our sort of outreach and wanting to be a part of the Waimanalo community. From there, the idea to create a mural took shape and a local artist named Prime was contacted. I'm a aerosol artist, a uh, racer in Hawaii, and my role in this whole thing is to tell Waimanalo's story from their perspective, not, not so much from the artist's perspective. I see myself as a visual interpreter, a visual storyteller, and it's just my hope to, to tell their story as authentic as possible. So the ideas for this mural came up. Um, it was a conversation I had with a Waimanalo resident by the name of Kalani Kalima. He's an educator, well respected in his community. So I had to, I went to him first to ask him about what, what is it that makes Waimanalo so special and what are the stories that exist here. And he took me on this excursion. In a whole day, we covered over eight stories and I was like, I have to take this and then condense it into a little scene and, and be able for people to reference this according to the place that, you know, that exists here in Wamanalo. So that's, that's pretty much the format. It's, it's just learning from them what the stories are and then trying to translate that so that way it, it can be used across the board. When people come here, they can point to the mural and say, oh, do you know this story? Do you know that story? Um, I think my favorite part is the honey because it's sharing your life to another person. It's just more than you know. If you're, they're sharing that breath to you, it's like they're sharing their whole life to you. So it, that's my favorite part, because it's just like, you kind of don't need to know the story. It's just like kind of shows in the picture rather, rather than like everything else around it. Yeah, it like captures your, your soul. <laughs> <laughs> Every aspect of the mural was carefully thought out. The colors were used to represent the eight Hawaiian islands, and each scene not only tells a story, they also represent Hawaiian values. We don't want to just give a visual representation, like, just for aesthetics. We, we want to also share the values that come with each story, because that's, that's the beauty of Hawaiian storytelling. So in this story, uh, in, in this whole mixture of stories, we, we touch bases on some of the values such as integrity, such as forgiveness, such as trust, such as honesty, and that's just some of the values that we want to talk about uh, in, this, in this portrait. It's really, really important because so many people pass by on a daily and, and they have no idea. They just see buildings, they just see restaurants and eateries, but where are the stories? So it's, it's our hope that in this, in this case they'll pass by and say, oh, what is that? You know, and then for the kids that are raised here that don't know the story, it's important for them to know where they're from. Waimanalo is a special place, and the Hawaiian culture is a genuine source of pride for the community. To learn more about the Waimanalo Community Mural, you can call the wall with the number listed on your screen to listen to stories explaining the history for each of the sections on the mural.